Hey everyone. So today's video is gonna be a little different. I'm gonna talk more about the PSP today, the PlayStation Portable, and I'm just gonna compare the speeds in between the UMD and let's say something that was saved on the memory card. So both of these are already jailbroken, but we're gonna be using the one to the left, my Japanese uh, PSP 1000 compared to the PSP 2000 uh, which will be using the UMD of Wedding Crashers and the, and the left is using it saved on the memory card itself. So there are some benefits, actually a lot of benefits to having it saved on the memory card by itself. But you know, sometimes it's nice just to have the actual physical memory because you know, you do miss something out on actually owning the game or the movie. It's, it's pretty cool to have these things. So there are benefits, there are some drawbacks. I would say the biggest benefit that I've always seen is gonna be speed. So the UMDs, if you don't know much about them, UMDs are like essentially mini DVDs. That's exactly what they are. They're mini DVDs that the PlayStation use. So this is definitely different when the PSP first came out compared to what I think at the time was the Nintendo DS. Nintendo DS was using cartridges, and cartridges are usually faster. So that's why you would see nowadays, for example, the Switch is pretty quick. Uh, other other things like uh, the N64 was a little bit faster. It's just they just write faster, but the capacities are much more limited. So it's the reason why PSP went to UMD, but this digital media did not really last even though there was a lot a lot of push to get this going with sh show movies like the wedding crashers or Chappelle's show there were a large library of movies and games available for the psp this was a real success that sony had on their hands so much that it was really hard to replicate and i think this is what eventually set the ps vita up for failure it had big shoes to follow so you know let's just try a little bit of it i don't want to get any copyright claims or anything like that so we're just going to try it out for a second see what the speeds look i'm going to try it more out on the games since the games i won't get as much of a copyright claim as the movies themselves so let's just try let's just press play real quick see if there's a difference let's do this one first actually no let's do this one this one will probably be a little slower okay all right let's see and you can get a little loud, so. So it looks like the movies play pretty much at the same speed as you would expect. Let's lower this one. That would probably save me anything. Now the issues with the UMD would be you know, some parts of it were very easy to break. So like the one to my right here is definitely, uh, you know, toting the line on coming apart essentially but look at that uh, we started the one to the right first and it looks like the one to the left is already catching up the movies already started on that side and you can slow you can hear it working too it's very interesting it's very interesting that the one that, that the other one started faster but it's to be expected with with speeds like this all right so you know what now i'm going to switch over to the let's do kingdom hearts it's one of my favorite games so let's do birth by sleep now the one to my right doesn't have a memory card in it so we're just going to try from the beginning and see how it looks see how it runs so let's let's just switch over now all right so we're back now we're going to try kingdom hearts so let's just let's give the one that's going to be a little slower a head start but that one go first now let's do the one to the left okay now you'll if you haven't already noticed the one to the left i installed a new screen on it so it's probably why it's brighter than the one to the right okay here we go okay storage media you can hear the other one really turning there. It's going. There we go. No, I don't want to quit the game. Let's start anyway. 
no. I'm still waiting on the one to the right. But the other one is definitely still going. I wonder if it'll be like this when I actually start the game. Man, and we started the other one first, too. Hmm. It's going. There we go. All right. You can tell this one's already way ahead. So let's just go into it. Okay. Okay. Here we go. Let's just do new game on both. No. The one, this one here has been through a lot. It's really, it's really a little messed up. All right. Let's do, you know, let's do new game on both. Okay. Big standard mode. Just a way everybody can see what it looks like. Okay. Okay, let's see. Okay, so that one's already started up. Not that it really matters, I think. Let's see. You can really hear it turning there. Well, yeah. It's definitely a speed difference. This is how it's going to be when you're actually playing the game and you're going in between load screens. So keep that in mind, anybody who has PSP. So if you're looking for a game like Kingdom Hearts, I've noticed that it does stutter when using the UMD, but it has no issues when it's saved on the memory card. So for a game like that, I might recommend having it saved there. And you know what? I will show you how to save it as well. As you can tell the one to the left is already three ahead. Let's see if we can skip this. Yeah, we can. Okay. I'll let this one skip first. There we go. Skip. Okay, here we go. Yeah, the other one's still trying to load. You can hear it, it's turning. So yeah, uh, playing off the memory card is definitely gonna be a lot faster. I just want to show everybody how much faster it is. That was my goal today. I hope I've achieved that for everybody. So, but I will also do, just show you what you would need to do just to have it saved onto the actual memory card. So you know what? Now what we're gonna do is, let's turn this off. Okay, this one's off. Let's take the game out of here. Okay. All right, there we go. Let's pop out, I have Crisis Core in here. Let's pop out Crisis Core. All right, here we are. So. Very simple. You need to get an application called UMD Dumper. Now, if people are having issues finding this, so just leave a comment, then I'll add it in the description on what you need, where you, where you can go to pick it up. That's it. Obviously you, have a, you already have a physical copy of it, so you just gotta put it in and it'll dump it straight to the memory card. And the speeds will vary depending on how big you want it to be. You can tell here it is. That's the game you want it to be. The normal speeds. You can change the speeds however you want it. This is the normal speed it looks like. It looks like it's gonna take 1.6 gigabytes. I have 12 gigabytes available. So I could definitely do it. I already have it there, so I'm not gonna do it. But and this and the right times do vary. So you know what? Let me just look. You can change the speed times. So if you want a high speed, 
Obviously, the high, higher the speed, higher load time, that's just how it is. It's very simple to do. We'll just pretend to dump it for now. That way you guys can see. Like, this is not going to be a five minute thing. This is going to take a little bit of time. Yeah, what was it looking at? Let's see. Let's count it off from. Okay, here's about one second. So, okay. So you're looking at about 10 seconds per percentage. So what is that? That's a good amount of time. Yeah, it's like 10 minutes. So yeah, it'll take some time. But once it's done, it's done. So you know what, I'm gonna cancel it now. LR and cancel. There we go. So thank you everyone for watching the video. Please leave a like and subscribe and Welcome to the channel if you just subscribed. Thank you very much. I like talking about these handhelds, all of them from the PSP to the analog pocket to Nintendo Switch to the Steam Deck whenever I whenever that comes out. So I do like talking about all these things. I hope everybody enjoys watching me talk about them. If there's anything anybody wants me to kind of go over, if I can grab it, I will. I'm grabbing things as I go. So thank you everyone. Please like and subscribe.